begin. We are so excited to celebrate the Bark for Bark 5th Annual Pet Walk at Rice University that provides critical programs for Bark's pets, including spay and neuter clinics and finding forever homes for these amazing dogs and cats. It's really important to raise money for, for Houston's animals. Um, you know, this is our city and uh, these are our animals and so we really want them to be happy and healthy. We are honored to be here today. Given the COVID-19, the ramifications physically and mentally, it could not be more important to help with this cause. Bark continues to deliver for all of Houston. This is the prophetic city at a cusp of the changing America. Bark is one of the divisions in my department, so we oversee it. We are so grateful to the foundation and to the Houstonians who support this cause. In the five years that this has been happening, we've raised almost $350,000 for the shelter. I'm thankful for the great weather we have today. I'm looking forward to a great crowd and just appreciate everybody coming out and supporting the Houston Bark Foundation and all of our pets who don't yet have a home, but we know they will. Uh, with the Houston Police Department, we deal a lot with animals when we get calls for service. So here for us, we support the Bark initiatives. You know, it's great to have our trailer out on site in the community to bring awareness. You know, we have some pets available for adoption here, but we also have our Bark Outreach team handing out information about the shelter, letting people know like, hey, if you don't find the right pet for you today, we have plenty of others at our shelter, 3300 Car Street. The donations we do here is very helpful to keep these dogs uh, and these animals and cats fed. Also the, uh, the vaccinations and then also the help. Uh, prevent other types of things that might have injuries and, and everything else. Hello. Hello. 